do a uh, short video because I plan on doing it anyways, but it's convenient that you don't know how to do it. Um, all right, now what it is, and this for the sake of the video, is if anybody that's played this game knows, when you make your character, you, you can uh, put your facial hair, sunglasses, uh, facial scarring, face paint, you name it, piercings on your character. Uh, but once you make your character, you can never change your hairstyle, your hair color, um, scarring, paint, piercings, any of that. Glasses, you can't take them off. Uh, yeah, I see on the head to the back and all that. Yeah, it was like that for for a long time, and then now, two years later, there's finally a way to, to take all that stuff off or switch it up whenever you want. And all it is, you go to your base operations and you make it all the way to the back of it. I hear you were half a step ahead of the cleaners. Uh, where it says the terminal. Oh, okay, hold on. I'm walking through now. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'll, I'll wait for you to um to get over here just in case because I don't want to like verbally tell you how to get there and then like you just run right fucking past it and you're like wait where? <laughs> okay. Yeah, but yeah, just go all the way straight uh past the electronics uh, staircase and then go down where it says terminal. Go through these uh blue things. Okay, come back up the stairs. True, behind you. And then over uh, here to your right, first door on your right, you see all the uh, well, janitorial no shit. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Now if you come up to the mirror, it says interact. Press square to interact. Oh. Cinematics, and then there you go. You can change your hairstyle, any style you want. You can um, change your facial hair, any style you want. Your facial hair color. Um, you can change up your uh, your facial scars you know um, same thing with the uh, face paint all that I mean some of the face paint is cool I mean especially if you know how to blend the stuff right for uh, like battling people in the winter well I mean the whole damn thing's the mm -hmm. winter but you know what I mean certain areas um, oh shit the only thing, though, is obviously if you are looking at stuff and you don't want it, you have to go all the way back to one to remove it. Um, you can't really see my neck too well, but because I got this damn scarf on, but yeah. There's more uh, neck tattoos than that, but I don't want to fuck up on that. Alright, and then yeah. If you want to uh, fade your tattoo or not, I have mine faded to 55% because to me that looks how a tattoo really does look if you've had it for years. Uh, granted, like you're not putting lotion on it. I mean, once you put lotion on your over your tattoo, like regular skin care lotion, suntan lotion, um, your tattoo will look bolder. I mean, as far as like a darker shade of black. Um, yeah, then like I said, with your uh, piercings and all that, um, just whatever you want. Yeah, because I remember like when I first met my character on Xbox, I got stuck with these damn glasses <laughs> like for the longest fucking time. And I was like, man, these things are annoying to have on. They just keep like the same damn thing, can't switch it. But yeah, after, I don't know, I guess two years later, they finally made it to where you could take the shit off. Yeah, I just go to confirm and update, and then, you know, that'll be it. Alright, so, I'm going to go ahead and uh, keep this video uh, strongly on that subject, and end it now. Okay. End it all. How you found no. out about this? <laughs> no, um, just curiosity. Like I'm always ex I'm always exploring. Like I always look at everything. You know what I mean? And like I think what it was, is, I think honestly what it was, I went to run through the doorway to go to go down here where you can interact with uh you know, these little shops or whatever, buy stuff. But I went to run through the doorway on the left side and I went to run, run around it like this. Like I don't know. I don't well you're not looking so you can't really see what I'm saying. 
I ran through the left side of the doorway and I shifted my character over to the right to, I guess, kind of wiggle into the damn doorway. And when I did that, I noticed these damn buckets and shit in this dark gray doorway. And I was like, oh, well, you know, what the hell is this? I've never been in here before. And I, and I started looking around the damn room. I didn't see anything, you know. And then I backed up and I seen where it said interact. And I was like, interact? Like, I was like, what the hell is that about? And then I just started messing around with it. And I was like, oh, that shit's dope. You know. So that's all it is, just, you know, fucking boredom and exploring. I mean, that's like on any other game, you know, like uh, GTA Five. I saw people find out about a lot of glitches, is they just get really fucking bored and they just start hey, figuring shit out. I don't know if you've ever played GTA Five or not, Red. Yeah. Yeah. New York. All right. This is Rick. Sorry, I'm not feeling real glitch. I remember Red Drew. So I went up oh. to, to like and subscribe. <laughs> no, no, I did that. Uh, I did that facepalm gesture, like when I said it. <laughs> That's why I said it kind of long. <laughs> All right, I'm in the video now. Hey, you can't do.